What is up guys, Epic Plays Gaming here. We got some more Nexomon Extinction, and as usual, by now, um, I'd like to start off the episode by showing you guys off my team since I changed it up. So what I learned about this game is that it's good to grind, and that's perfect because I like to do that in my free time. Uh, while I wait for like my videos to like convert to MP4 and upload and all that stuff to YouTube. So, uh, what's new on the team? So we evolved Mjern into uh, Falarnia. I caught a uh, Gekoko, one of the like electric starters um, on the map and evolved it to um, Camilivo. Camilivo, I think. That's how you pronounce it. Uh, I got a mineral uh, Nexomon, um, Wazer, which I read online is pretty good to have. It was between Wazer and then I also caught a Fordle. It was like a, a rock turtle thing. And then we got uh, Psyche or Siki. Sikai? Psyche? I don't know. Well, let's just go with it. But it's a mega rare grass type that I came across that I feel like was pretty clutch because uh, it has a healing move. So it restores 100 HP, and not only does he have a healing move, but also uh, uh, Camilivo got heal as well. So that's going to be clutch on the team. And I actually wanted to basically have you guys see uh, Camilivo evolve too. So let me remove that core, and we're going to stick that onto you so you can get 8% EXP. And I actually did go back and give that crazy tree, demonic tree thing, um, <laughs> those next I'm on it asked for just to get the rewards. A trouble mind stands here. What's wrong, kid? Yes, indeed, we live in a dying world, but you have the tools to change that, don't you know? Nexomon, they can do marvelous things, can't they? Come, let me show you the miracle of the Nexomon. Oh, wow, okay, funny enough, I want this uh, psychic type. I kind of set my team up for success as far as uh, as far as type advantages kind of go. Oh, okay. Kind of forgot that psychic is good against electric. So let me go back into um, the Deca. And I need to catch this one. I need to catch me a, a, a Mai Mai, Mimi, Mai Mai? Yeah, Mai Mai. I need to catch me a Mai Mai uh, so I can trade it into someone and get another EXP booster since those stack. And that'll be another extra like 3% EXP that I can get my team having. Ah uh, yeah, level 18. Absolute barrier. Any attacks that would reduce this Nexomon's HP to zero, instead reduce HP to one. Uh... I guess I'll get rid of- I don't really use Pummel, so I guess I'll get rid of Pummel for that. Arcane Siphon. Damage received from the next ghost type attack is nullified and instead restores 50% of the damage received as HP. Uh, no, nah, I'm good. Okay, we got three level ups. Okay, and here we go. We got uh, Psyche, Psyche. Maybe I'll just call him Psyche. Sick kebab. <laughs> so it's Sicky and then Sick kebab. Okay. I like how they gave him a stick. What a beautiful thing. I never seen Nexmon so perfectly synchronized with their tamer. You are destined for greatness, Blades. You'll see if you keep moving forward. Oh, I know. Oops. Wrong part of the grass. Okay, I'm thinking that's the way to go. Uh, what's up with this guy, though? Uh, this is the worst. Hey, are you alright? Uh, a t tyrant poisoned me. Ah. Whoa, is there something we can do? I can't move at all. You'll have to bring me a bunch of anti poisons. Five anti poisons ought to do the trick. Aren't those only for Nexomon? 
I know what I'm doing. <laughs> Just bring all the anti-poison you can. Uh, let's see if we can help this guy, Blades. I'm not sure where the closest place we can buy anti-poisons from is. Okay, well I don't have five of those. I think I don't. Yeah, no, I only have three. I'd need two more of those and then I can hook them up. Let's get these battles too, just to get the EXP. Hey you, have you been training at all? You gotta be ready. Tyrus can attack at a moment's notice. Like this. Okay. Moonstay. Okay, so that's what that, uh... That early on fire type, uh... Nexomon Stinger evolves into Moonsting. I don't know, it looks kinda... Looks kinda dumb to me. No lie, I like Cruncho. I don't know if I'm gonna keep Cruncho on the team because I caught another Mega Rare uh, Water Pokemon. Or, not Water Pokemon. Water Nexomon. And I don't know if its stats are gonna be better than Cruncho when Cruncho evolves again. But, for now, I'm keeping him on the team. I like the design. I was hoping to get uh, blub blub puzzled from that. Okay. Uh, I think wind. Wind is good against mineral. It's one of the things where I have to like keep trying to remember. Forget everything you know about Pokemon type advantages. Like. Oh yeah. Okay. Well. We'll just switch to plant, I guess. Because, like, some stuff makes sense and some stuff doesn't. Uh, Bullet Seed. I like how they have that move there, because Bullet Seed's also in Pokemon. Look at that, everybody's getting a nice a nice amount of EXP. Wazer uh, leveled up to 20. The thing about Wazer is Wazer takes a while actually to evolve. I think I have to get it to level 45. I think that's what it said. Not bad, Blade. Sorry for the ambush, but that's just how tyrants work. They don't play fair. You never know when those beasts will attack another city. It's tough, so stay strong. Okay. All these battles, like, so close. At least there's a lot of shards, though. That's convenient. I'm like, is it, is it worth doing this battle for, like, the EXP? Eh, yeah, we'll do the battle, because then we have that thing there to heal up. Cave's not the only place with shards to mine. You can also find them out in the open. But I'm not letting you get your hands on these. I called... I already... I already took them. What do you mean? You're calling dibs on something I already took? Oh... My, you did not have to do that much damage. Forklet. And you... and you burn Croncho? Invincible. What? Well, this was not working out in my favor. But I got Hideka out here. Even with it not very effective, we're at a high enough level to where uh, we can <laughs> still do so much damage. It's fine with me. Okay, Crancho, level up. 
Take whatever shards you find around here. Of course, caves are still the best spot for mining. All right, let's keep moving east, or, or try to. Can we flee? Yeah, there we go. Well, I don't want to fight you. Okay, there we go. Oh, wow. This is crazy. Look, look how many stairs there are. Whoa, look at that thing. They call it Grunda's Chasm. Legend says that a whole city used to stand here, but it collapsed after a huge monster crawled out from underneath. Okay. That's how the story goes, at least. Oh, you could hear us all the way over there? It's Amalai. At the bottom of this chasm, we built the city of New Ignitia. Why would you bother doing that? If Brenda truly was a fearsome as the legend goes, we figured that no tyrant would dare step into his domain. Huh? That's not a terrible idea. Did it work? No, not at all. In fact, a tyrant is terrorizing Ignitia as we speak. Girl, what? <laughs> a tyrant down there? The nerve that he has, attacking right in front of me. I will rally my tamers. I will reclaim my city. Okay. Reclaim your city, girl. This is not a battle for bronze tamers, so stay put. Now, if you'll excuse me, I need to organize our mission. I mean, I'm getting pretty strong out here, though. Oh, yeah. If you guys are, like, wondering about my uh, follower now, um, I went in explored a little bit more too and got to this cave uh where i unlocked the vault actually and the vault had like two huge red chests one came with this uh companion and then it came with this other item um let me go to inventory it came with the tribute of decay i don't know what this is supposed to do but it just says it's an ancient elemental relic emitting a faint aura other than that, there was also, like, a good amount of money up in there. But at least we made it here. Uh, let me register this warp stone. Register that. Heal the squad up. Do you have anything here? Uh, I can't remember if these, like... Oh, wow, we, get, we can buy super potions now. I'll buy nine. Probably don't even need them like that. Oh yeah, let me buy some of these. Just to shut that guy up. I was like, I need, I need the good stuff. I wonder if you really can buy vault keys later on. Are you a smart shopper? Ever heard of a discount voucher? Just having them in your pockets enough to reduce shop prices across. You can collect and stack as many vouchers as you want. Oh, I didn't even know that. So anti sleep. So can I buy anti sleep from this person? Anti. Okay, no, I can't buy anti sleep from you. Well, when I get some more anti sleep, I'm definitely going to trade it with that person to get the discount thing. Cause hey, I save money that way. So they told us to stay, so am I supposed to just go in here? Yep. Hey, look over there. Looks like Amalai is recruiting tamers to save New Ignitia. Okay. That's fine with me. Do your thing, girl. Huh? Why are you here? Don't even bother, I can handle this whole tyrant thing alone. But... Amalai isn't letting bronze tamers fight the tyrant. You rookies don't know how to negotiate with an adult. I'll beg and cry and make her uncomfortable in front of everybody. She'll have no choice but to let me in. I can't even tell if you're serious. Ah, it's our turn. Oh, great. <laughs> 
What is that supposed to mean? Why can't you take on normal jobs? You're bronze tamers. You can't stop me from making bad decisions. Ugh. Fine, fine, you can act as backup and yes. Okay, he just ran off. You don't even know like what the plan is, dude. Blades, Ross is not someone I can reason with. I need you to look after that jerk, please. Most Samir is very powerful tyrant of fire. You may want to prepare a team to counter him. The desert around us has plenty of mineral type Nexomon, and then the frozen tundra has water type Nexomon. Climb down the chasm to meet with your teammates. Don't be too reckless, Blades. Okay, well, at least they let you know, so. Okay, we get a perfect berry, coins, all that good stuff. Well, it works out that uh, I trained up a little bit. What are we noticing? Hey, you there. I heard that you're on your way to free Ignitia. New the stores down there are low on supply because of that Molsimer fellow. Come get your items while you still can. I already talked to you. Uh, what's this person do with the feather? The world is vast. Kid, your next one can grow very weary in no time. Have you ever tried a stamina core from Param? They'll let your next one fight for much longer. I can give you a few quality cores. What do you have to offer? Super ethers? Where do you get super ethers from? Oh wait, I can buy super ethers, right? Yeah. I like to do this just to get like the star out the way too. You'll be able to fight and fight for hours. Okay, well, let's see. Uh, I guess I'll... Well, no, because you guys are going to be bad in that fight. It was saying mineral and water, so... I know you're probably going to die really fast. So, we'll try to give you... One of these, 12%. Oh, okay, that's plus 15 on that. And then... I guess we'll give Croncho one as well. Uh, just like I, I don't know who like to really start out with, but maybe I'll start out with you and I'll take uh, the EXP bonus stuff off. Actually, let me just remove it all from you. Because you have one too many. Because this, I mean, like this, the sooner we can get uh, you leveled up, the better. We don't care about that. We care about increasing our defense a little bit. Alright, let's see if... Uh... Oh yeah, we can. It should save as soon as we get in there, right? Yeah, it's saving. <laughs> Alright, fellas, our mission is plain and simple. Descend to Ignitia, kick down the gates, and beat up the tyrant, Mulsimer. Oh, I like this guy. <laughs> but sir, most of them are alone destroyed the entire city. Yeah, shouldn't we wait for our Grandmaster or something? Relax, rookies. I'm a gold tamer. Absolutely nothing will go wrong in this mission. Something will absolutely go wrong on this mission. <laughs> now let's get going. We've got a tyrant to hunt. I like how Coco has like no faith in us. Oh, I wanted to I wanted to mine back there. Come on. Yeah, I was like, what are we waiting for? <laughs> the city was built as deep as possible to serve as a stronghold against the tyrants and other threats. Evidently, that didn't work out. Wow, there's nowhere to run, huh? <laughs> you said it, but the guild tried to build bases in all sorts of extreme environments, hoping to deter the tyrants. 
underground, underwater, skyward, you name it. In the end, all of them succumb one way or another. I believe it. Why would you try to, like, build it down here and, like, come on. Eh, what was that sound? This must be the part where everything goes wrong. <laughs> you got that right, Coco. Oh, snap! This is... This is Mulsimer? Look at Coco crying right there. It's... It's a dragon, sir. Yes, I can see that, fool. But why? Dragons rarely ever go this deep underground. This doesn't make any sense. I thought dragons hunted tyrants, though. Incoming, sir! Brace yourselves, he can't beat all of us. Or well, maybe he can't. Oh! Wait, 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 those two people just died! <laughs> Why is the dragon attacking us? They're only supposed to hunt tyrants. Incoming again, sir. <laughs> Hold tight, we're almost to the base. Just a little longer. Okay. Now, they were just... They were just killed. <laughs> this is your fault, Blades. This is sort of the thing only happens around you. <laughs> you know? He's right. Coco, really, bro? He's supposed to have my back. Okay. Hey, Blades, wake up. Maybe if I... Blades, the dragon got your arms! <laughs> My arms? No. Get used to it. I can't find the others. They might have fallen near the city. Okay, they're not dead. Let's hurry. We can't just stand here with the dragon nearby. You are right. We can't. The city of Ignitia. Okay, cool. But guys, uh, with that said, I'm going to end this episode off here. Make sure you leave a like for the video. Hope you enjoyed the video. And make sure you leave a like for the channel. Well, not a like, a subscription. I got that mixed up. So make sure you subscribe to the channel. Helps out the channel a lot. With that said, stay sharp. Later.